Hey, welcome back to Feral Art. How you doing? Mm. Um, tonight I'm going to be doing another chaos ribbon swipe spin. It's a little spinny this time. Um, and our colors tonight are for my base coat. I am using Amsterdam Lamp Black. I have Chromacryl White with Satin Enamel. Um, Chromacryl is something that Nate Bright told me about. And it makes pretty cool um, effects on its own sometimes. So I figured we'd put in a little Satin Enamel. We'll see what happens. I have Blick Metallic Magenta. I have... Decor Texture Turquoise, which when mixed with Floetrol or whatever your current PM is, just acts like paint. I have a mixture of Amsterdam Ultramarine Violet and TLP Grenache. Why? Because I can. Um, and my CA... I'm going to try this Pebeo Studio Iridescent Rich Gold. Uh, three parts Australian Floetrol, one part that. Uh, it is hotter than the ninth level up here. So, just be warned that I'm liable to be fussy. I've been fussy all day. I don't know why. Some days you're just fussy. You ever have that problem? you just fussy happens to me all the time. Anyway, um, I've had these paints mixed for a couple of days because I kept thinking I was going to get up here and paint, but it's been so hot and it is hot right now because I'm right under the eaves and this house, for whatever reason, you would think in New England they would have really good insulation, but this house has none. So just, just say it. All right. So um, there's a little 12 by 12 convexo. I don't know how this is going to work out. It may be a real crapshoot. I want to say crapshoot because I can't say the S show word here on family channel. Anyway, so, um, I'm just going to do this. We're just going to see how it works. Okay. Okay. There we go. Twala. Got my little spinner going here, ready for prime time-ish. So we're just gonna see what happens. Mm. Worst thing that happens is it doesn't work. Lord knows I've had that happen plenty. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna do the thing. Cause why? Again, cause we can. I'm trying to mostly get this. I'm gonna have some parts that probably run off, but I'm trying to just kind of get it covering the flat. Okay, let's give this a torch poo. This is when it's going to start going because now I'm going to start adding color. We're just going to do the chaos ribbon again. Um, first, I'm going to look at me. Got all metallics. What is wrong with me? There's something seriously wrong with me, you guys. Metallic. Metallic. E la 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 bum, 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 bum. Might as well have a little fun, you know. Why not? There it goes. Sliding off the edge. It's okay. Alright, there's that. Now we're gonna go with this here. Odd mixture of yeah, no, we're not. 
we're going to go with this um, Blick Metallic Magenta. Yee, look at me go. Honest to Pete, I'll just run your paint around. It's fun. Have a little fun while you're at it, you know. I figure I've been so dang crabby all day, I needed to do something fun. Whew. Ain't nobody likes a crabby feral art. Not even feral art. Ugh, hot. All right, we're going to take some of this her stuff. I'm going to put a little here. Ooh, you guys, sniffy. A runny nose. It gets hot, I get a runny nose. It gets cold, I get a runny nose. It's all great. And now I'm going to swirl around some of this white. <laughs> Ew, what was that? Get off. There was a booger on my white, in my white, somewhere around my white. Get off. That's just disturbing. I'm going to put this white down, and then I'm going to go back on with uh, uh, a little bit of... Oh, good. It is starting to cloud a little. Yay. A little, little bit of this. And a little bit of this. This is that Grenache purple weirdness. You know me. I like it weird, you guys. All right. Now, I've got this handy dandy little Liquitec freestyle palette knife that I got from Blick, I believe. Um, and that's what I'm going to be using. <sighs> naughty, naughty Jesus. I'll just, I'll just put it on my table. I don't care. All right. Just give that a little, little shimmy shake. All right. I probably should torch this, huh? Okay. Now. This hasn't weathered very well. Um, it's wood and it's painted and the paint just likes to fall off. It's like it's been drinking tequila or something. I don't know. You know, tequila makes your clothes fall off. I guess it could make your paint, your paint fall off too. I don't know. It's a mystery. Okay, there we go. Now we got a paper towel here. We'll let this run around for a second. I don't want too, too much. But I do want enough to do what it needs to do, you know? Now, we learned in our little mini collab on Sunday that we should do short swipes. But this is sort of a short uh, short deal altogether, so we'll see. Yeah, see, we don't have to with this because it's already short. Short. Ha ha, I see cells. Cells are coming. Cool. And then we're going to do it again. Look at them. Yeah. Okay. Let that run around on there for a second. Get everything nice and coated. Eh, eh, eh. All right, now we're gonna go a visa way. There we go. Look at them little suckers forming on there. That's cool. Once again, baby wipes to the rescue, as always. What can you count on feral, light, feral art for? Baby wipes and a righteous mess. All right, so 
Now I'm going to take my handy dandy. <laughs> I'm not going to marble this. It'll run all over the place. I was going to do a Nate. My Nate. God, I can't speak, y'all. Words are hard. That's going to go over the edge anyway. I don't know why I'm worried about it. All right. Most of this is going to go. Probably what will stay is part of this, part of this, and this middle. And what did we learn from our last one? Well, Kelly, what we learned from our last one was don't get too fancy with it. Just do a little here. And a little here. And maybe a little right here. That ought to do it, honestly. <laughs> so I just keep going. It's okay. All right. Now, we're running off the sides already, but I want to cap that up real quick. I am going to take some of this black that I have left and just pull around these sides a little bit. It doesn't have to be thick on there, it just has to be wet because what? A dry canvas is a what? Thirsty canvas. for this lovely apron that I'm sporting here. I really like it. It's very cute. And it's very lightweight, which for days like today is very important. All right. I'm going to move everything back because i got to get this thing away from me a little bit. I am going to spin this slow because I really don't want paint all over my life. Poofy white. I got poofy white. Mm -hmm. Yay for me. Just 
interesting how I did that. There's not much left in there, so we are good. <laughs> oh, really? That Grenache, man, down here? Woo! That's hot bananas. Okay, I'm gonna get me some cups. I'm gonna clean this up, and I'll let you watch this stop, but I'm gonna get to getting. Alrighty. clean up and I'll bring y'all back in for a little flower. How's that? Okay, here we are with our wet results of our little Convexo Chaos Ribbon Swipe. Um, I like it. I think it's really cool. I got the fluffy white, puffy cloudy, and I believe that when this lacing is dry, it'll be uh, pretty sparkly. And look at this down on this bottom. I hope I don't lose all that. Look at that Grenache. That's a Grenache with ultramarine violet, and I am sort of liking it. Um, the blue went on vacation. I mean, you can see it in the middle parts a little. But on these outer parts, mm, it just kind of left. Maybe... Maybe because it's that texture deco art stuff, maybe it's just heavier enough that it just kind of plunk. I don't know, but it's there. You can see it there. Um, so let's do a little flash flash and see what we get. Okay, here we are with our little, little flash on. I see that Grenache going shine, shine, shine. Look at that. Whoa, baby. Hello, darling. You are beautiful. I do love Grenache. Y'all know that. Now, not seeing a lot of the gold sparkle, but I do see the gold lacing. Um, maybe it's sunk under the white, but I kind of like the look of it. That's kind of cool. And then here's my big swirly girly stuff. A lot of little air bubbles in there. Look at them all. You look like little zits. Um, but yeah, that blue just went, took a powder. But I'm loving the way that Grenache is peeking through there. Look at that. Look. Wah, 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 wah. Look at that. Yowie, zowie, y'all. Pretty, pretty. Anyway, there's our wet results. I'm pretty happy with them. Uh, would kind of like to know where the blue went, but as long as it's peeking through part of it, that's cool. It'll in integrate very well, I'm sure. So anyway, wet results. Be back with the dry ones. And here are the dried results of my latest Chaos Ribbon Swipe Pour. Um, it's going to be really pretty when I seal it. All this Grenache in here. Look at this. Whoa. So pretty. Um, the blue kind of took a powder. It's in there. You can see it if you get, you know, to looking in here. It's just sort of an accent pop. Um, I know what I'm going to do different next time, but I do like this gold cell activator. I think it's going to be really pretty when I get the sealer on it. Um, I'll probably use Gamvar. I might actually resin it, but probably not. Um, so anyway, that was my little Convexo Chaos Ribbon Blowout. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for coming along with me on this crazy ride. And I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.